you. Now, to demonstrate the speed and movement of the typical comet, I give you the remote powered mini comet. <laughs> You're slipping, Neutron. Real comets have long, pretty tails, not little stumpy ones. Only when they're filtered through the spectral light of the sun, Vortex. Care to tell me how I get a giant hot ball of gaseous radioactivity into the classroom? Hello, children! Ah! Get it off me! Down, boy! Down! Uh, whose comet is this? <laughs> oh, that tickles! Oh, no! Oh, no! Not the face! Ah! And that concludes my presentation. Thank you. Mr. Neutron, you're lucky I'm in a good mood today. And do you know why I am? Because your mom packed your favorite lunch? Kara? Principal Willie with mom doesn't pack his lunch. He probably has his butler do it for him. Duh. Oh, did your butler rub your tummy when she put you on the school bus and tell you your lunch is made with love? Oh, stop talking! No, I'm happy because the Lindbergh School Chorus has been asked to sing at the opening of the town's new stadium. Oh, how exciting! Awesome. Now my singing talents can be revealed to the whole world. And apparently some other upstart band called Grey Star will be playing as well. Grey Star! Grey Star! Oh my god, that is so cool. Now kids, quiet down. Shh, shh, shh. Thank you. The auditions for the chorus will begin after school today, as the stadium opening is only a few days away. <laughs> well, I hope to see everyone there. At least the talented ones. I'll be there! <laughs> Well, I have to get back to my lab and make preparations for my trip to Twonkus 3. Twonkus 3, the comet. You know, the comet that I have just been describing to the class? Uh... Ah! Okay, Sheen, I gotta go. Good luck at the chorus rehearsal. Right, like I'll need it. Besides, no one has been rejected from the Limburg chorus in 50 years. Jimmy Neutron in A Comet Cometh. Aha! According to my calculations, Twonkus 3 is finally coming into range! Looks a little unstable, but I can't wait to see what scientific samples I can bring back from up there. All I need to do now is find the parts I need to fix my rocket ship, and I can blast off. Jimmy, if you ever see the interact icon, move close to it and press the triangle button to see what happens. Do this now. Excellent, Jimmy. Other objects you can interact with are now in the control room. Try them out and meet me in the lab when you are finished. Now all I need to do is deliver it to Vortex's house. Ah, home sweet home. Where would a genius be without his lab? Now I need to find those parts. I wonder if I can find them in the lower levels. Okay, Jimmy. 
You can control the camera with the right analog stick. Move the right analog stick left or right to rotate the camera. Try this now. Sometimes you may want to position the camera directly behind you. Press the L1 button to do this. Go ahead and try, Jimmy. Excellent, Jimmy. Now follow me to the next lesson. You have activated a checkpoint. If you ever run out of health, you will return to the last checkpoint you have activated. You can collect objects when you walk over them. Pick up the object in front of you now. Cool! A gizmo piece! Well done, Jimmy. If the object is an invention piece, it will be added to your inventory. Now, follow me. Wow! Sometimes I even amaze myself. Just one! You can never eat just one! Mm, I think this one needs perfecting. My idea machine! What ideas do you have for me today? Super Chew Bubblegum! Guaranteed 1,000 chews! I like it! I think this one needs perfecting. You will need to jump on different things throughout the game. If you press the X button once, you will do a normal jump. Press it a second time when you are in the air, and you will do a double jump. Jump now to reach the pickup. Cool! A gizmo piece! You have found enough items to create an invention, Jimmy. Press the R1 button to bring up the Inventor Face. The Inventor Face has four categories. Gizmos, Inventions, Super Inventions, and Blueprints. Gizmos require two objects. Inventions need three objects. Super Inventions require four objects. Press the up or down directional buttons to change category. And press the X button to move across to the objects. Press the up or down directional buttons in each column to change available objects. Then press the X button to see Think if an invention can be created. If the pieces match up to create a new invention, it will be added to your inventory. You can see your current inventions in the Hypercube. To access the Hypercube, press a directional button. Once the Hypercube is visible, use the directional buttons to scroll through your inventory. Select a gizmo or invention and press the X button to use it. Great job, Jimmy! Now explore the lab and follow me to see Goddard when you are ready.
Maybe Goddard can help you get that pickup, Jimmy. You have found a Goddard upgrade. When you pick it up, Goddard will have extra commands. They will be available from your hypercube. Keep an eye out for more upgrade packs. Why don't you try them out now? Oh, like this should help me out. get something to, to lay down the panel, the gate will stay open. Another invention piece for my inventory! I'm sure I can make something cool with this invention object. Genius never takes the stakes. You have found a blueprint, Jimmy. Blueprints are plans to show you how to create some inventions. Check your inventor face at any time to see your blueprints. This should make inventing easier. Good work, Jimmy. You have now completed all the tasks that you will need after you leave the lab. I may come back to teach you some extra abilities at a later stage. You need a few more things, Jimmy. Go back and get them.
You can't expect to go out in the world without enough things to invent with. said I could get a new pet, as long as it doesn't set off my allergies. That's great, Carl. Uh-huh. So, you want to come to the pet store and hold the animals up while I sniff them? Uh, sorry, Carl. I have a date with Twonkus 3. Twonkus 3? Yep. It's a comet that is entering Earth's orbit in... Puke and Pluto! Gotta run! Twonkus 3 is entering Earth's orbit in an hour! So, what I miss? Oh, Jimmy's dating a comet and I have to go sniff animals. And they say I'm the weird one. Well, guys, you got a blast! Jimmy Neutron in Blast Off. Wow, Goddard! This is a blast! Uh, uh. Stop at this discarded space station and pick up some neutroleum fuel canisters to super boost me to Twonkus. Hmm. 
Better land away from those defense systems that are firing at the meteor storm. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Looks like there is zero gravity here. One of those meteors must have knocked out the station's gravity system. A tether will stop me from flying off until I can think of something. I have to use this tether to keep me on the space station. But it will only get me so far. What I can invent with this? Maybe I can use this ma- Think! Think! Right left! Make it somehow.
Luck is three. The terrain looks a bit unstable, but I'll take us in for a nice, soft landing. Jimmy Neutron in Crater Capers. Well, not a smooth landing, but a landing just the same. Now, how are we going to find our way back after we collect our samples? Oh, I get it! When we're done exploring, we'll let the music guide us back to the ship. Good idea, boy. Look, it's three. We're finally here, Goddard. Adventure beckons. Yikes! Blockus is really unstable. I'd better be careful. Just what I was looking for. I think Goddard can help me retrieve it from the ground. Dogs like to dig, especially robot ones. This will upgrade Goddard's digging abilities. like an upgrade pack for Goddard. Let's give it a try. If I throw this, Goddard will bring it back for me. Guess I could use it to have him break through things. Okay, boy. Fetch the bomb. Go, boy. Good boy. Who's that good robot dog? Goddard should be able to help out here. This looks like a job for Goddard! Okay, Goddard, excavate this! Good job! Wow! An invention piece!
Dink, dink! Right left! One mineral site to go! Okay, I have all I need. Let's head back to the ship, boy. <laughs> 